its reputation as a city of tech-savvy people in the run-up to the election. They're using blogs to discuss everything from women in politics to criminal candidates. Get ready for it. Churumuri, a little sweet, a little spicy. The tagline of one of India's most popular blogs perhaps best describes its own writing. The blog that began in Mysore takes a bash at just about everything from cricket to politics to literature and gets nearly 8,000 page views a day. Sample this post on the Congress fielding women against the Gaudas. This is less about women and more about the men behind them. As many Congress women have asked, especially with Mamta Nichani, are these two women, both related to powerful male politicians, the only women the Congress could find in a party that has been around for so long? I think what we've tried to do with Chirmuri is to create a platform where you talk about things which the mainstream media now for a variety of reasons, but largely laziness and too much of money, you know, doesn't touch and won't touch. Chirmuri uses media reports to examine issues like money power in politics or candidates with criminal cases, issues that are certainly getting its readers' attention. So in India's IT capital, can a blog have any impact on the elections? Perhaps not. But Churmuri is certainly an indication that someday, like in the West, Indian blogs too will not just respond to the news, but even make it. In Bangalore, with camera person Lokesh G, Prasad Ramurthy, Fendi TV.